Hey y'all, hey! How y'all doing today? It's your girl, Miss Free to You. And if you're wondering, Free, what the hell you got on? Uh, highly requested video I have for y'all. Y'all ask, and here I am, the deliverer. This is a shapewear video. So if y'all want to see what I got going on, come on through. Welcome to my channel, Miss Free to You. Enjoy. A mistake without the lesson. See, the best teacher in life is your own experience. None of us know who we are until we hey fail. Guys, make sure you hit the notification bell when you subscribe. Follow all of my social media outlets. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. Hey, Bye. Hey, what's up? So just a fair warning. Um, when I was doing this shaper video, I um didn't realize that while I was doing it, but then when I looked over the video, I noticed that the shaper that I am wearing from Shaper Mint, great shaper by the way. Um, it is completely transparent in the back. I didn't, again, I didn't realize that until after I looked at the video. My kids didn't hear they didn't tell me either, so. But, yeah. Anyway, um, just know that if, that it's showing. My underwear is completely showing. Thank God I had some on. Because <laughs> if I didn't, this would be a different kind of video. But, yeah. Um, I just wanted to let y'all know that's not something that you guys are into. That's fine. I understand. Just want to pre-warn y'all that, yeah, you can pretty much see. But, hey, what would an honest video be if I didn't show y'all the honest truth, right? Alright, hope y'all enjoy. So, here is my shaper. I have two types of shapewear that I'm going to show you in this video. So this is the first one. And honestly, the only type of shapewear I typically wear is shapewear that's made like this. Meaning, the shapewear that's made like um, shorts. It's the most comfortable for me. And honestly, I got, you know, I'm a big girl or plus size woman, so I have thigh rubs. So if I wear, I have shapewear that's made like the panties, but they are uncomfortable for me depending on what I have on. Because like I said, my thighs do rub. So this is, if I'm wearing a dress, if I'm wearing a skirt, this is my go-to shapewear because it eliminates the thyroid or at least the filling of it or the chafing or whatever have you. And then it's comfortable, you know? And I can stand like this and not feel totally exposed as opposed to wearing the panty one, like the panty fit, where, you know, you're not necessarily exposed, but you know, you're showing, you're good, right? All right, so this is made by, this one here is made by mating form. This is the one that I have been wearing for a while now because I've had this on hand for a while. I got it, I can't remember where I got it from, but I want to say I either got it from Ross or Dee Dee's or somewhere like that. And I typically sell these at your discount stores like Ross, Dee Dee's, Burlington. Um, it's not too transparent. It still have, um, it doesn't like wipe out my shape, so I still have my curves. And it is not uncomfortable. It's very, very comfortable, you know has that snapback I like to call you know very good elastic it's very functional you can pull it up and down um and it stops right I want to say about maybe six inches above my knee well I mean you can probably pull it down but that's how I prefer to wear it right and then as far as the bra is concerned you could wear it with any kind of bra so whatever kind of I typically like to go along the, go along the lines of full coverage but in this case I got this bandu that I purchased from Walmart the straps do come with it, but it's perfect for something that you will wear that has no straps or um, like a halter or something along those lines. So that's what I'm wearing today. And it's made with lace. Again, it's a bandeau, but it has underwire in it and it has lace across the top so it doesn't give too much cleavage if you don't want to or if you don't want to at all, it's not showing, you know? And it's pretty decent on support. I got this in shapewear. When I buy my shapewear, I have to size up. Um, because I found that if you get your actual size, so typically in stores, I wear probably about maybe an extra large um, or 1X. But in shapewear, I have to size up to a 2X because I bought shapewear that was my size and it did. I couldn't get it on. Like it was way too tight and very uncomfortable. And even though the whole idea is for it to suck you in, I have to be comfortable. You know, because when you eat, it's like holding you too much and you can't breathe in it, you know? So, um... I got this in a 2X. Now, in a minute, I'm gonna show you the next shaper that I got. Matter of fact, let me grab it real quick. I ordered this from, everybody has been asking me in my last rainbow video, where did you get the shapewear? What kind of shapewear is it? And where can I buy it? So I'm gonna put the description, the link in the description bar so you guys can find it. But I purchased the shaper that I had on in rainbow haul, in my rainbow haul, um, from Shaper Mint. And um, I have another rainbow haul for you guys that is it's gonna be pretty dope but you guys be the judge um i'm doing something a little bit different so make sure y'all stay tuned for that so i got this from shaper mint you can find them on instagram this shaper guys is pretty pretty good um before i put it on for you 
does. Let me talk about it a little bit. So I got this. Now this shapewear, I wasn't sure how to fit. Oops. I wasn't sure. <laughs> Hold on. I wasn't sure how it would fit because it was my first time trying them out. And like I said, I like to make sure that I'm doing good on my sizing. Because me personally, guys, if I have to send something back, I will. I hate sending stuff back. I'm just going to be honest. Like, I've bought things in the past. And I just held on to it and gave it away. Because sending things back to me is a hassle. You got to wait for them to get it. If they get it. You got to wait for them to process it. Then you got to wait an additional. So it's like two, three weeks you're waiting to get your money back. And sometimes it's just a hassle to me. So I tip it anyway. Um, this is, I got this in a size, um, I actually got, um, yeah, a 2XL. I got it in black here. And then it comes with a Shaperman offer booklet for 2020. So, it comes like that with this booklet. So y'all can see, hopefully the light is not So here's the moment y'all all been waiting for. I'm gonna put on a shaper for you guys, and we're gonna get into it, and I'm gonna show you how it right. So here I am, I'm back. So let's talk about it. So again, it came in this little baggie. And it gives you a description of what you have, right? So it's high-waisted, shape or short, holds everything in, super comfortable, stays in place all day. 90% um, nylon and 10% spandex. So that's a good point I wanted to bring up. It is not tight, but it's, it's got, don't have a lot of spandex in it, but just enough to do what you need to do, right? So it comes all the way up my waist. Which I, so I got a lot of stomach. Excuse my scar, I had a major surgery. So here's how it looks without it, so you can see. And then once I pull this up, it literally sucks everything in. And what I like is you're seeing it on a real every. I don't mind that. Yeah, but it rolls down a little bit. Um, it's it's pretty fitted because when I move my legs, it's a little bit of restriction, which lets me know that's actually working and holding me in. Um, and then here, I'm going to pull it up a little bit. So you just kind of pull it up so you can get it to your comfort level and pull that part down so it sucks all of this in. So not bad. And it comes just like the other one. This one comes about four inches, three and a half, four inches above my knee. So, not bad. In a way, it looks like I have a whole one piece instead of a two. Again, I size up for comfort. If you want like a really tight suck, suck, suck in, then you might want to get your size. But again, to keep from having to send it back, I sized up. You have a little outfit. Okay, so I was, I was looking for a dress to put on so you can really, like a body con dress so you can really see. But I felt, let me put it on with something a little more practical. So I have this two piece set um, that I had showed you guys in the video. I'm gonna try to re remember to link the video below. But um, here is the pants. I'm gonna go ahead and put them on on camera. So y'all can see they're high-waisted as well so and they're really long and they have I guess they would be Palooza pants or back in the day we used to call them elephant leg pants already hot wasted so you just kind of pull it up and then you pull the shirt down a little bit probably don't have the right bra on for this but y'all can see from the side pretty smooth and seamless right not bad not bad I mean it's not gonna eliminate your stomach completely but it's at least gonna keep things smooth and seamless and I don't have a lot of hips but you can kind of see them on you know Well, I got some curves, so I just completely wash out my curves. If y'all want, I can show y'all how it looks in a dress too. You know why not? So y'all can see. Okay. Not bad. I don't feel restricted. I can still move my legs. Y'all, how it looks in the dress. Right there in the dress, we want to try to put it on right on camera. And this is a body. 
body kind dress that I got from ASOS. I want to say a little over a year ago. Maybe a year ago. Yeah, I think a little over a year. Just so you guys can see. real deep you know people just be looking real deep <laughs> but aside from that you can't really tell see not bad and yeah like I said I have a belly but it looks more smooth and polished and a little you know just clean line you know not bad I don't mind letting it all hang out but sometimes you know you want to just keep things a little bit in place and together and this will make you do it so not bad not bad at all so y'all let me know what y'all think i hope y'all enjoyed this shapewear video um give your girl a thumbs up and leave a blessed comment if this is your first time here and you like what i'm doing make sure y'all hit that subscribe button because you don't want to miss out on all the fun okay and i thank you guys so so much for joining me love all the love y'all been giving me big shout out to all of my day one subscribers all of my in-betweens and all of my newbies love you guys thanks so much i have a good one Who's next? <laughs> Who's next, <Emily? laughs> Who's next?